Look at this. <laughs> Look at this idiot. And the build I'm gonna try is gonna be a uh, ropes. So you might actually survive. And yep, there is a third poof. This is what Amiibo Snowball looks like. Come on, another poof. Boom, and another poof. Boom, and there we go. Meepo still carrying us in the early game. Let's keep trying our luck, shall we? <laughs> Once the Meepo dies, suddenly we are heavily outnumbered and yeah, we basically there is no way for us to win. Now our Meepo is going ham and deleting everything. You shouldn't roll. Gambling is bad. So it seems like we are completely annihilating this guy. Wow. And all we have to show it to oppose them is one Meepo with Dagon. Hello everyone and welcome back to this humble abode of gameplay and memes. Today, we're once again returning to the dirty streets of White Spire as we continue our journey through Dota Underlords. Alright, so this time around, I hope I can show you something special. It's been a while since I've uploaded a Dota Underlords video. Unfortunately, sometimes real life gets in the way, and there is nothing really I can do. So right now, in terms of rank, this is of course rank standard. In terms of rank, we're still playing with... Uh, I'm still Big Boss 1, absolutely no progress has been made, Bruh. just gained like 100 MMR overall. <clears throat> Kinda unfortunate, but what can you do? Sometimes it just happens. And the reason it was happening is, well, because I keep trying new stuff, and because the modern, me the modern day meta seems to be quite a bit more random than it used to be. Gloves of haste, headdress. Hmm, Void Stone is also interesting. Huh. Well, let's go Void Stone, I'd say. Might come in handy. You never know. Or might not. As a lot of people can attest... As a lot of people can attest... Uh, the modern day meta is a lot more random. Thanks to all those... Uncontrollable 3 stars running around. So... Sometimes things just don't work out. I think I'm gonna buy Queen of Pain here. <clears throat> but I think I can still, eventually, do what I must do and ascend to Lord of White Spy. I, I I'm sure it will take a couple more months to, for Valve to, re to release a new major update. And then, you know, and by that time I can definitely progress back to Lord of White Spy. Definitely. Definitely. Come on. Do you know who you're talking to? Look at this Meepo, look at this, <laughs> look at this idiot. He had all this time to summon another Meepo and he just refused. Okay, so there's another Meepo and there are two bounty hunters as well. That's hot. Interesting. Someone saying hot. I think it's one of my friends might be spectating me here. Uh, what if we... Okay, let's do something like this. I'll give voice tone to the Meepo. To make sure he actually summons another Meepo this time. Alright, so there's another Queen of Pain. There's another Venomancer. Uh, I suppose we can sell Slaughter for the Queen of Pain. Uh, in terms of... Yeah, I don't think I need Conca in the build I'm gonna try today. And the build I'm gonna try, I think, is gonna be... Uh, rogues. And for rogues, you don't really need a uh, Konka. Konka is great overall, but in this build, I can't quite find a place for him. Okay, there's a two-star Meepo. Hmm. Do we really want that, though? I think the answer is yes. And also we'll do this. And also we'll do this. And then uh, this. This way we'll get three assassins and a Meepo. Good for you. Alright, so yeah, now our objective is to, well, first of all, we need this to not happen. You know, Meepo just getting attacked immediately. That's terrible. Okay. If these Meepo will still do a decent chunk of damage, because you know he's uh, two stars, and no one is attacking him anymore, so he might actually survive, and yep, there is a third poof. So yeah, this is what a Meepo snowball looks like. Sometimes you just, sometimes you just get, sometimes your Meepo just snowballs. Okay, so Blade Mail, Blink Dagger, Stonehold Pike, huh? Huh, very interesting choice indeed. I think I'm gonna go for Pike. It might have been a good idea to reroll, but might manage like this. <laughs> Alright, so Anti Mage is moderately contested. Bounty Hunter is kind of all over the place. However, Meepo, the most important part, isn't contested at all, so. Heck yes! 
I think our chances could be pretty good here, yeah. Everyone's still buying Phantom Assassin. Okay, so this person also has the th um, uh, four units. <clears throat> and most importantly, they've got four knights. So our chances aren't looking very good here. Okay, so that's one poof. Come on. We gotta do another poof soon. Come on, Meepo. Stop getting bi- uh. Okay, have it on down. Okay, come on, another poof. Boom, and another poof. Boom, and there we go. Nice. Let Meepos run over the competition. Of course, Voice Stone isn't the best item you could have for Meepo. <sighs> but we might get another good one soon. What can I do? I'm buying these just, uh, uh, you know, the usual deal to increase the chances of finding another Meepo or another Bounty Hunter or Phantom Assassin. And what do you know? Right there is another Meepo. I can even buy him here, because you know he is, uh, <clears throat> I'm over 20 gold. Let's see what happens next, so once again, here we can buy all of these. Aha, so here we've got, oh, here we've got our Meepo getting heavily focused, that's never a good sign. Okay, but at least his proof will get interrupted, that's nice. But Tusk will die pretty quickly here. There is another Queen of Pain ultimate. Boom, both Slaughter and Earth Spirit got killed by the poof, and yeah. Meepo still carrying us in the early game. Very nice to see. Again, I bought everyone to increase chances of finding Meepo, Queen of Pain, Bounty Hunter, or Phantom Assassin, or even Anti-Mage. For some reason, I'm still not seeing any Anti-Mages at all. Even though there aren't that many in-game. Alright, so this... This is awesome. <laughs> this is great. But now we need to sell... Can we reach... Hmm... We actually can't reach... Uh, 30 gold just by selling. I think I'm gonna risk it and wait it out. So, yeah, the next thing I'm gonna do after achieving 30 gold is start rerolling heavily to get a 3 star Meepo and hopefully some other 3 star rogue character in the process. Okay, there goes Queen of Pain. No more stuns from the annoying Chaos Knight. Uh, Phantom Assassin is already dead. Queen of Pain screams twice, actually manages to survive, and yeah, we're super good here. Boom! Easy! Phantom Assassin, of course, being a 1-star, does absolutely nothing, but once she gets upgraded, I'm sure we can solve the problem. And yeah, once again, we have reached 30 gold, so now, uh, let's see what we get here. We get absolutely nothing. Now, how peculiar. Uh, well, there was a Slark there. Okay, there's Phantom Assassin. That's nice. Uh, okay, so Tusk, we don't need Ma uh, Magnus, we don't need Storm Spirit, we don't need another Phantom, another nothing, uh, and another Meepo. Okay, so. <laughs> that was a nice one. <laughs> the only one who can stop Meepo is Meepo, yep, yeah, sounds about right. Unfortunately, now he's getting focused, so he. Okay, he survived to at least screen, uh, poof twice, which is great. Ow, 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 and we lose. Boo. But we have already reached 30 gold, so we won't really suffer too much for it. So this person here has four rogues already, but it doesn't look like they're rerolling for any more. So we might be okay in that regard. Stonehall Pike, Arcane Boots, Dragon Lance. Hmm. Well, I think I'm gonna reroll that. Okay, these items are even worse somehow. I don't know, let's give... <laughs> maybe let's give Quelling Blade to Phantom Assassin. A Pudge, Dazzle, not interested, there's Alchemist. Very much interested, and there's Anti-Mage. So now we can play four rogues, if we want to. The problem is we aren't finding anything else. Well, let's keep trying our luck, shall we? <laughs> So we're getting a couple more Phantom Assassins, we're getting a couple more... Okay, that was some very nice damage, yes. Okay. Need this Meepo to poof again, there we go, Chaos Knight is down. Unfortunately, of course Meepo won't be able to handle all of these guys at the same time. But he can do a decent chunk of damage to them, just... <laughs> Unfortunately, they just have too much healing, so... Uh... For now, they take us down. We need to buy these because, you know, again, tier 2. We want these guys. Queen of Pain is moderately contested, but yeah. 
Same thing as before. I think... I think I already did, by the way. <laughs> I think aggressive tank Joel will work very great, or very fine. I don't think very great is a real expression in the English language. <laughs> that was a nice one. Yeah, for some reason we just stopped finding Meepo completely now. Not sure what's up with that. Definitely shouldn't have. But yeah, a Joel can do a very a pretty good job protecting Meepo. I hope the Phantom Assassin... Okay. I was gonna say, I hope the Phantom Assassin keeps attacking the, the summon. It looks like Queen of Pain almost managed to scream twice, but not quite. Come on, one more proof. Nope. Wrath of Nature destroys us, and yeah, here we... KILL THEM ALL! <laughs> here we're not really going to succeed, <laughs> to say the least. Gonna take like 10 damage here. Oh. And Joel is taking everything like a man, but it's not gonna be enough. Nope. Oh, it's only 8 damage, but, you know, close enough. Anyway, we need to quickly play our anti-mage and get a- Okay. I- yeah, I grabbed both of them. Nice. So now we need to re-roll. There's the alchemist. There's anti-mage. Okay, so we can actually stop rolling. And play... Yeah, I think I'm gonna do just that. Play myself some more... Uh, damn, <laughs> these items are really awkward. Yeah, so by playing four rogues, I increase the survivability of my team substantially. Unfortunately, here we run into anti-mage, and our alchemist does nothing for the longest time. And they have a uh, enthrall in Essex, which is the worst thing ever, and we lose. Ah, you know, just my normal luck. Nothing to see here. There's someone contesting my stuff despite no longer even playing rogues. It's just assassins. Think I'm gonna give the pike to Meepo here. And then, I don't know, void stone to Alchemist maybe so he activates faster. Yeah, if it wasn't for the anti-mage, I would have had a much better chance of uh, winning there. Alright. Lots of Queens of Pain we're finding here. Very cool. Not enough Meepos, unfortunately. Still uncontested and still not showing up, huh? Alright, sure. Whatever floats your boat. The, the game is suggesting to buy the Dazzle here, because, you know, Dazzle is also a poisoner, so it will complete three poisoners like that. But I think we can wait for now. And everything will still be fine. Okay. So the Chaos Knight is down, uh, the Shadow Shaman is no longer gonna summon any more snakes, and we win. So yeah, this was a bit of a more successful application of Meepo. Yeah, and I'm not buying Dazzle because I think uh, Viper could provide a better poisoner for us, but for now we need to keep assembling these guys. Arcane Boots, Silver Edge. Yeah, I think Silver, Silver Edge is a pretty clear choice here. I'm gonna play the Pike on... On Bounty Hunter, I guess. Quelling Blade on Anti-Mage. Now let's see. Okay, come on! Okay, now we need to reroll super hard. And not find anything, apparently. Okay, okay. Alright. <laughs> so we spent like 10 gold on rolling and we still couldn't find a 3-star Meepo, somehow. No idea what's happening with this game, but something is definitely amiss. Considering there is still no one who is looking for him. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Once the Meepo dies, suddenly we are heavily outnumbered, and yeah, we basically there is no way for us to win. That's fine, though. I promise you, this build is legit. We just wait and see. We just need to stop getting unlucky and not finding anything we need. And then everything will be great. Ah, uh, there's Meepo. Alright, so we can reroll. There's two more anti-mages for us, and... 
All right. So shall we roll, or shall we now try to level up and actually play everything we have? And I think the answer is we need to still roll, because we do need to fight Phantom Assassin and everything else. This is another enthrall in Essex, and our... Okay, okay, everyone is melting, that's good. Okay, come on Meepo, keep breaking them Meepo. Very nice, and yeah. So basically that's what 3-star Meepo does, as long as he... As long as he doesn't get focused immediately, he's gonna do absolutely great things for you. Maybe I want, yeah, and I think I want Joel more towards the front, so he tanks a bit more. Yes, indeed. Okay, we need, we can sell this Magnus, doesn't really matter. And yeah, we're steadily approaching a 3-star Queen of Pain as well. I wish my Phantom Assassin progress was slightly better, but it is slightly contested, so... I guess you shouldn't expect too much from it. Okay, so there is four Heartless and four Brutes. This could be quite tough for us to beat. But we'll see. Okay, so Life Stealer is down. That's pretty huge. Okay, so the problem is our Meepo... Okay, yeah, our Meepo is doomed, so he's gonna die extremely soon here. Didn't even have the courtesy to proof one more time. Wow. Okay, you should have definitely shurikened him and won me the round. But, no, oh well. Just the normal luck we're, getting, we're having. So yeah, eventually in the late game we could replace anti-mage with... Uh, okay. Maybe we don't replace anti-mage with anything yet because we suddenly started fighting him again. <laughs> Almost 3-star Queen of Pain. And then we will definitely need to level up, because we are running out of space here. <laughs> and time, too. It's not, uh, it's not completely horrible, the health we have. But, oh my god. That's a lot of beefy dudes we got here. Okay, come on, Meepo. Stop being stunned, Meepo. Stop, Alchemist, come on. Hello? Okay, they just... Alright, so, we did a lot of damage. But we still lost, because our alchemist didn't feel, feel like using his ability. I guess he was silenced by the Earth Spirit all this time. We actually almost, almost leveled up to 5, naturally. We've been rolling for so long. A tree in essence, mango tree, eel, scepter. Hmm. I think we want something better. Okay, this is definitely worse. I guess I have to pick Skullbasher here. Maybe Skullbasher will work slightly better on. Okay, that was Bounty Hunter. Come on. Hello? Alright, sure. Or we could just not fight anything once again. When we run away from everything. Cocky. Very cool indeed. No, we weren't cocky, we just were super unlucky. That's it. <sighs> okay, so multiple Meepos with Skull Basher. I am expecting great things from them. Come on. Keep copying. Yep, there we go. Impossible! Impossible. <laughs> Okay, uh, yeah. Yeah, so the flaw of Meepo is right here, you can see. When Meepo dies, we're basically out of options. I wish Anti-Mage stopped running in and dying. Like he was doing there, but now we seriously need to roll. God damn it, I missed it again. Fuck. Uh. What? Wow! On the last goal, <laughs> it took it took all of our gold to find something that we should have found ten rounds ago. Amazing! We will make sure 
Yeah, Meepo, <laughs> Meepo definitely needs a better item, but this will work for now. Okay, for some reason they're just refusing to die. Not sure what's up with that. I guess they, they do have a lot of healers. But now, <laughs> now our Meepo is going ham and deleting everything. Great. Alright, so this was the example where Meepo Snowball actually worked. But yeah, the amount of uh, the amount of units we're finding is absolutely unacceptable. Uh, yeah, uh, between finding three star anti mage and three star phantom assassin, I think phantom assassin is way more important because when she uh, gets three stars, she will be able to get the rogue alliance as well. But now we seriously need to accumulate some gold because it seems like no matter what we do, we won't be able to find it, even though the other guy stopped contesting it completely. Okay, come on Meepo, come on Meepo, I'm gonna need some serious miracles out of you Meepo. Alright, my Crystal Maiden just got everything thrown at her, I mean Queen of Pain, and yeah. So basically this is what happens when you roll and you don't find anything. What? If I somehow make it anywhere to top 4, then it should uh, serve as a lesson for everyone else. You shouldn't roll, gambling is bad. <laughs> Unless, of course, some kind of a miracle happens, which, at this point, it definitely won't. What if we put the Void Stone on Meepo and bash her on Alchemist, maybe? Because, you know, Meepo using Poof faster no might make more difference than, you know. Okay, so there's the Assassins. Oh, I see, so Queen of Pain. Of course, the other guy found the Queen of Pain first, before we did, because, you know, this game is fair and balanced. Alright, can we kill anything else before we get wiped out? Nope, not even close. Alright, so Dagon on Meepo sounds way better, so I think that's what we're gonna do, and yeah, Voidstone can just relax for now. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, this is the final, well, not the final, but like, one of the final pieces that we need. Now I just... <laughs> nice one, bro. So yeah, we have no one to play voice tone on pretty much, but now that our Meepo has a Dagon... Oh my god, it's the friggin' three-star lifestealer. Unbelievable. This guy, like, it seems... It almost seems like this guy didn't roll at all. And yet here we are. With the friggin' three star lifestealer already. Damn. Well, at least that lifestealer is the only thing to survive, thankfully. But I think we might want to switch our corners here. Something like this. Okay, finally. Yes! So our Phantom Assassin finally gets an upgrade, so I guess we can give her the pike, or, well, actually. Since Pike only works on uh, Queen of Pain, I guess I have to give it to her instead. We almost made something work. I'm not sure if it is gonna be different, but oh my god, it's 3 million Terror Blades. And a whole bunch of other nasty stuff. That's not good. Okay, well, at least we're destroying the... <laughs> okay. So it seems like we're completely annihilating this guy. Wow, okay, I think he should be knocked out. <laughs> of course, of course, one health. Of course this guy is gonna have one health remaining. <laughs> uh, some people might look at the uh, three-star Meepo and say it's bait. Okay, one, two, three, four. We've got nothing more to lose, so might as well do this now. I think... Uh, Okay, I'll actually let this guy be here, and Phantom Assassin like here. Didn't find a Mask of Madness for our Phantom Assassin, but we did find... Uh, at least we didn't find a 3-star, so that's cool. Okay, who is this? Or is this the Assassin? Oh, yep, this is the Assassin player. Okay, let's see it. Okay. Yeah, good, good, good talk, right, bro. Just give up. 
Okay, so Queen of Pain is attacking the Joel. So, yep. <laughs> All right. So someone got eliminated. It's it was yeah, he was the guy with one health. But we are now. Oh, I don't want to say we're stabilizing because we clearly aren't. But at least at this point, there is no reason to roll anymore. So instead, we can just proceed to accumulate some gold, find something better, and maybe actually take top four. Who knows? We just wrecked the assassins. I'm still afraid of this. Uh, of this uh, the, the, the brute player, and we are naturally we are against them right now, of course. Our Queen of Pain should do some serious damage though. Okay, uh, Meepo got stunned at the worst possible time. Okay, we're still doing great damage with Dagon. Okay, we blew up everyone. <laughs> all right, all right, let's go. Boom. Okay, nice. So we did secure top four. <laughs> so I guess I am. I might be uploading this video after all. Because <laughs> you know, I don't have all the time in the world to record. So that's nice. Okay, Radiance, Horn of the Alpha. Who would hold Radiance if I if I were to buy that though? Don't get me wrong, I think it's a great item, but uh Monkey King Bar. Okay. <laughs> Probably not the best choice, but you tell you what, I can dramatically boost the damage of my Queen of Pain. Sorry, there was some kind of a beep in the background, not sure what that was, but... Oh well. Yeah, so now we're playing against one Assassin player, one Brute player, and all we have to show uh, to oppose them is one Meepo with Dagon. <laughs> Sounds intimidating, alright. Okay, come on Meepo. Do something, Meepo. Okay. Okay, come on. Nope, the Meepo is dead. And uh, our Phantom Assassin keeps doing something weird. Okay, I think we should survive here, yep. But yeah, a horrible place all around. Meepo got blown up instantly. Which should not be possible, we did our best to hide him. Whatever, I guess I'll, I'll place him like, like here. Maybe then you'll have better chances of survival. Alright, there's Viper. Is Viper better than Venomancer? How much health do you have, Viper? Uh, stats? 900. Venomancer has 1500. Okay, so I guess he is better for now. We might actually pick up Viper here because I do believe he is going to be better eventually. Oh. Okay. So that's bad. The Brute player actually switched corners. Our Terra Blade. Oh, I, I was gonna say our Phantom Assassin is getting destroyed by the Terra Blade. Meepo is already dead. So we basically lost no matter what. Okay. Okay. And someone fought a 3 star Alchemist and we're eliminated. No oh well. Well, <clears throat> anyway. Even so, even though we got eliminated like that. No! Even though we got eliminated like that, I still maintain that, you know, we can win. We can still win. Even despite everything. I think this build definitely has its place. I think it's definitely awesome. The main problem is that you need to be luckier than I am, because as you saw right there, I, not only was I contested, I also didn't fi couldn't find the pieces that weren't contested for a while. Like Bounty Hunter and Meepo took way too long as well. So, yeah. Just, uh, you know, don't be me, basically. And this build will work wonders. <laughs> so, that's all for today. Thank you all for watching, I really do appreciate it. If you're enjoying what you're seeing, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I see, I'll see you all in the next one, so goodbye, and take care, everybody.